Hello everyone, hope you're all having a lovely day today. Um, I just wanted to make a really quick, like, I guess, not really update, but just a really quick uh, video. Um, just kind of explaining and talking about why I get so, I guess, defensive over the fact that the gospel is, you know, not of works and that our salvation is not based on ourselves and how we don't do anything to get ourselves saved other than just simply believe the gospel that Jesus Christ paid it all. Um, you know, because I know in my videos I can quite come across as, I can come across as quite passionate and sometimes that can be interpreted as defensive, aggressive, um, which I totally get and I apologize. Um, but, uh, just kind of, I guess, explaining why I get so uptight about that stuff. Um, is because the whole, like, idea slash interpretation, I think, of what most of the world sees Christianity as is a works-based religion. A lot of people see Christianity and our faith as a works-based religion, and that's just not the case at all. And that mentality of seeing it as a works-based religion or just another religion like, leads people to a ton of false assumptions. You know, they think that we're judgy. People think that we're people who are just gonna condemn you at the drop of a hat or that we're not understanding or that we don't have any compassion because we're just like, oh, you're not as good as us. And I hate that. I hate that that's the mentality. But at the same time, I don't blame people for having that interpretation of us because of people who are workspace salvation promoters and lordship salvationists and the reason why i get so that why that just bugs me so much and why i get so i guess passionate in my videos where i'm like it's not of works it's not of works it's just simply believing is because people you know if we're going to try and get the world saved if we're going to try and get as many people as we can to christ they're not going to come to christ if they think that we're a bunch of self-righteous pretentious I don't want to say it, but you know what I'm thinking, you know, uh, people, um, you know, and, you know, I have, I'm sorry, I keep saying, you know, I didn't realize how much I say, you know, in my sentences until I've watched a few of my videos and I've been like, wow, I say, you know, a lot. Um, so now I'm going to try and stop, but I have a lot of friends who are non-Christians, you know, obviously I have my really close knit group that is all Christian, but I have a few really close friends, a lot of friends, you know, that are non-Christian. And, you know, when they find out how much my faith means to me and how serious I take my faith, um, they'll sometimes be like, you know, oh, wow, I wouldn't have expected that from you. Or I wouldn't have expected you to be like a Christian or such a hardcore Christian. Or, you know, they sometimes think I'm a liberal Christian. And I'm just like, no, that's not the case at all. Like, you know, the salvation is not based on how good you're being or how good you're trying to be, or what you're doing now. It's literally just, we believe that the Son of God paid for our salvation, and that's it. Like, that, that's really it, you know? And then after you're saved, obviously, the Holy Spirit comes and helps us to grow in grace. And, you know, it, it's kind of this whole, like I said, this whole idea of doing the right thing just simply because it's the right thing. Um, you know, because when people see Christianity, they sometimes think of us as people who just are being nice to earn a spot in heaven, or just because it's one of our rules to be nice. No, that's not the case at all. And so, you know, I think once we get the word out and more people realize how we don't think that anything we're doing is getting us to heaven, you know, that is something that will bring people closer to Christ. And I genuinely believe that because there's not a ton of people who I think have the mentality of do the right thing just because it's the right thing to do. Um, and again, that's not me trying to sound like self-righteous or anything, but like, if you think that your good works are earning you a spot in heaven, then they're, they're selfish, you know? You know, you can't really do, like, I, I've heard a few preachers or teachers on YouTube, preachers or teachers that rhymed, um, on YouTube say, you know, you can't really do any good works until you're saved. And I think that's true because if you don't already have the mentality that you're already saved, then your good works are almost, you know, like I said, they're almost selfish because you're doing them to try and get saved. So I keep looking to the distance. It's just, I like, I feel weird, like staring at the camera as I'm thinking. But anyway, I just wanted to make this quick video. Um, I hope everyone's doing well and hope everyone's safe. I know the East Coast here, we just got hit with a blizzard, um, which is actually still currently happening outside. So any fellow East Coasters, I hope you are all staying safe. Um, 
as well as everybody else. Hope you are all doing okay. Um, and yeah, hope you all have a little rest of your day, and God bless.